Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for our August 2022 tarot reading. And this will be for the sign of Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers the highest good of all. And at the beginning of the month, I'm going to take a card from the top, middle of the month. I'm going to take a card from the center, and the end of the month, we're going to take the bottom card. Okay, and let's see what we have here. So, we start out beginning of the month with the Six of Wands. That is such a beautiful, beautiful energy to start out the beginning of the month. The Six of Wands, okay, is a very nice, victorious card, okay? Um, this card could mean for some of you, and again, this is a collective reading. Some of you may be getting a promotion, okay, uh, at your job. Um, others of you uh, may be getting recognition for some type of achievement uh, that you've, un, you know, you've done a lot of hard work towards and now people are starting to notice your hard work. So you're getting maybe some kind of certificate. Maybe you've taken an online class. Uh, maybe you've been uh, doing an internship or, or maybe doing uh, some kind of, a, how could I say it, not a, a journeyman, well, an apprenticeship. Yes, apprenticeship. Maybe you're doing something like that to further yourself. Um, but whatever it is, this is a step in the right direction because you're being noticed for whatever hard work and efforts that you've been doing, they're paying off. Okay, and you're feeling a sense of satisfaction with your, your accomplishments and you're feeling very pleased with yourself in the beginning of the month. And this type of success is well deserved and you have every right to feel pleased with yourself. This is, you know, good news coming in. And then in the middle of the month, we have the Ten of Cups. Boy, it doesn't get any better than that, does it? Now you're feeling emotionally satisfied. Uh, the Ten uh, is a completion, okay? And the Cups are our emotions. So with the Ten of Cups coming in in the middle of the month, you're feeling very stable in love. Maybe you're in a relationship now that is a lasting relationship, by the middle of the month, maybe it has moved to the next level. You're feeling very content. Uh, for some of you, this might even be possibly marriage. Maybe some of you will be offered marriage proposal in the middle of the month. Okay, this is the ultimate card of happiness and love and stability. Okay, it you know, when a cup reading or cup reading, <laughs> I'm just so excited for you. This is beautiful, the energy is just amazing. When this card shows up at a reading, it represents happy, you know, happiness in your home life, you know, or lasting success in a relationship. It's it's a card that symbolizes, you know, committed and contented love with permanence. Um, and for some of you, it may very well be that, you know, maybe marriage is in the cards. And then at the end of the month, we have the emperor. So he's the card of stability, the emperor. Okay. Now this could represent a boss, okay, or a father figure in your life, somebody who has authority over you, you may be dealing with at the end of the month, okay? And it could also mean that, you know, maybe there's a decision that needs to be made at the end of the month and you need to make the decision based on facts and with a calm head uh, because the emperor bases decisions on facts, okay? He doesn't let his emotions rule his mind when he's deciding on something. He's not influenced by emotions whatsoever. And maybe at the end of the month, there's going to be a situation that may be very emotional and you need to make a decision on it, but you want to think about the facts and you want to think about it logically. Uh, this is also a card, you know, of great progress in, in financial stability at the end of the month as well. So you're getting uh, beautiful, beautiful stability and love. Maybe, like I said, for some of you, marriage could be in the cards. Home life is beautiful. And then you have this card that could be financial stability coming in at the end of the month. You're being recognized. You're being recognized. And, and that could possibly be what's going on here, uh, where maybe this is your boss giving you a promotion, moving you to the next level. Or financial stability, maybe you're getting more money in your paycheck. Uh, for whatever is going on, maybe from this recognition and hard work here. Uh, it is an amazing month for you. This is a great reading for you. I am so happy for you. If you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up, share it, and above all, subscribe because I will be back with more.